quick human hair wig wearing care tip for you today. I have a brand new wig that I just washed and I'm going to be reviewing. This is Lola by Eniola Hair. I haven't even cut the lace. Look at that lace, you guys, and that hairline. That's not what this video is about. I'll put a little bit of detail in the description. A review will be coming. But here's the thing. I always wash a brand new human hair wig because I like to show you guys how it air dries. I think that can be really helpful as you're thinking of making a purchasing decision and what kind of styling a particular type of hair might need depending on how it dries. Here's the thing. Human hair absorbs water and it swells up when it absorbs the water. Well, your hair is knotted into the cap. If those knots swell up and stay swelled up for too long, they can loosen and cause shedding. So when you wash your human hair wigs, you always want to dry the cap, even if you're going to let the rest of the hair air dry, which I always do. I have two ways I do this. Sometimes I stick this that I bought on Amazon on a mannequin head. You stick the hair dryer in here, the cap is over the top, and that dries the cap beautifully and you just can let it sit there and dry. Today I was feeling a little lazy and I decided I was gonna hold my wig and dry it like this with the diffuser. The problem with doing it that way is you can get a whole lot of lift in the front as you can see. So if you like lift, dry it that way. If you don't and you don't wanna have to use heat to flatten it out, put it on that head and dry it that way. 